I believe there is a new role for companies and it is to mobilize people, not just within their organization, but outside their organization um, it, to pursue broad, broadly defined opportunities. Um, you know, I, I, I'm, um, I, I think there are very few companies that I've discovered who actually have a narrative in the sense that I talk about it. Um, one company that I think is an interesting one in this context is actually Apple, um, where they have a narrative which was condensed into the slogan, think different. But if you unpack the slogan, there's a narrative there. Of we had generations of technology that forced us into these boxes where we became standardized commodities. Um, for the first time in history, we now have a set of technologies that allow us to explore our unique individuality and personality, um, but it's not automatic. It's not going to happen just because the technology is there. It's up to you. You have to think different. You, and are you willing to do that? And I think that's an interesting, again, framing. It, and by the way, yes, we have some products that can help you do that. But the narrative is about you. It's about the opportunity you have. And I think it explains a lot of why uh, for many people, Apple has become kind of a religion. <laughs> they uh, are, you know, fanatic about about Apple. And yes, part of it's they they have some great products, but I think much more it's that narrative that touched something within us that said, "Wow, there really is an incredible opportunity, here and I need to do this." It's not up to it's not Apple, you know, telling me what to do. It's up to me to figure out. I'm going to think different. So I think that that's an illustration of the kind of opportunity that all companies have to frame a narrative that really, and again, that's not just marketing hype, 